Yo, what is going on, Weedy Gang? It is your boy, Javron here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to get coins inside of Madden 18. So, there are different ways to get coins in Madden 18. You could play a head to head game, you could play solos, you could even look at the snipe, you could even like look at the auction house and snipe some stuff. I'm going to show you the ways I make coins, and hopefully, these tips can get you guys to a million coins way quicker than me. Right now, I'm at 31k. But hopefully, I can get up to 100k real quick. But anyways, first I'm going to show you guys, the first thing you guys should do is go to Objectives and Progress. So as you guys see right here, when we go to Objectives and Progress, you have different tabs. You got the Daily, Improve Overall, Win 25 Solos, Squad Goals, Complete Sets, and Mutt Master. So what I recommend is every day, if you have a chance, you complete all these right here. So right today, um, I believe today is August 23rd. Uh, 2017 so what you want to do is I got to win a game or play a head-to-head -head game win two games complete a set and purchase a pack from the store now you see you get little incentives right here so if you win the game you get a hundred coins you win another game two games you get a hundred coins and you complete a set you get a hundred coins and if you do this you get 50 coins so if you do all four of these you get a combination of 450 coins Plus, you get a quick sale containing up to 50k. So you can either get one to 50k extra after you get the 450 coins. So that may not sound like a lot. It might be a gamble too. But if you go with it, you might be straight. You feel me? So here's another thing right here: improve overall. Win three games as a 76 or higher. I am a 76. I haven't played a game yet. I'm just trying to build this team up. But anyways, I could if I do that, I'll get 2,000 coins if I win three games. And then I win three more games as a 78 or higher, I get 2K. But honestly, I think the best way to do this to get a whole bunch of coins right away is if you just get your team over this, bro. Get your team like an 85, and every time you win a game, you'll get one for this, 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 and this. So you're knocking all of them out. So once you win four games, you knock this one out, you knock this one out, you knock this one out, and you knock this one out. So you get two four six eight k from that and plus if you complete all these you get 15 k so hey that's 23 ish k right there i believe 15 plus 15 plus 8 is 23 so like i said that's a good way to get coins another one you get 3,000 extra coins if you complete all these solos and stuff i'm almost done with these so i get i'm gonna get 3,000 coins uh, you do th these are different right here. You don't get coins from this. Uh, you get little squad tokens that goes into like getting coins, upgrading elites, I believe, or upgrading legends, I believe, something like that. This right here, complete sets, you get a thousand extra coins. I almost got to complete one more, and I get hey, look. This is another thing they like stack on. So if I complete this last one, I get a thousand, and then I get an extra thousand. And you remember, if I go up here, if I complete a set today, I get a hundred. So it's the small things you do. You can get coins like that. And Mutt Master, I'm not even going to talk about this, but as you guys see, if you guys complete all this right here, you will get 500k coins and a Sean Taylor. So far, I got 14 done, but you have to get your team under levels uh, 70 overall to get <laughs> this thing done. So I should have did that ahead of time, but hey, man, I'm going to just do what I got to do. It's going to be hard, but it's going to be a long way because you got to complete all this. I don't know. Someone might have Mutt Master done this weekend. I'm not going to front. Anyways, I'm going to the next tip right now. All right, guys. So another way you could get coins easily on Madden 18 is obviously doing solos. As you guys see, I completed the kickoff solos. I did four the journey, and I got a lot more to go. But if you just do these solos, bro, I'm gonna just go ahead and look at. I'm gonna show you guys some of these solos real quick because they're really simple and stuff. Like you get 400 coins and you get defense. You get 400 coins and a defensive reward pack. Like, that's easy money. Like, 500, 600, 700. It goes up, and you get all the way to a 1K, bro. And you get an offensive reward pack at the end of that. So, all you got to do is just grind these out. They may be long. They may be boring. But if you grind them out, you will get a whole bunch of coins. And plus, if you finish the journey, you get an 86 Devontae Adam. If you finish the uh, gauntlet, I'm not sure what you get on this one. Uh, I know you get exclusive long shot players if you complete this. And... By the way, I'm not doing long shot on my channel, bro, because everybody's uploading it and it's too dry died out. So I'm not doing that. Anyways, and then you got this one right here where you get beat the challenges to earn uniforms, coins, and all that other stuff. Alrighty guys, so the last way to earn coins on a Madden 18 is honestly you have if you want to be dedicated to it, you just have to be smart and know what to buy. So you gotta use the auction block. 
And I'm not going to lie to you guys. My first time on auction block this year, I saw an 82 overall Robert Quinn going for 100 coins. I don't know if he forgot to change his prices up or someone trolled him. But I got him, sold him for like 7k, and that's the profit. So what I do, I go to buy, buy now price, and I just scroll down and see like if I can find an elite first or like find like a a straight like gold player, and then I'll get them on my team like right here, Kevin Lawson. And then what I what else I do? I have my head open on my other team on my other monitor, and I just look up people. And yeah, I missed the Kevin Lawson, but. You gotta be quick with it, you know, because the times on here is kind of weird. But you, if you have Mutthead on your team and you have this, uh, his name is Never Lawson. I'm stupid. But <laughs> what I'm basically saying, if you have Mutthead open and you got this, then you could go ahead and get you some good, cheap Mutt players. And right now, the auction block is kind of bad, so I might have to make an updated tutorial on the auction block because it's really bad right now. Like, let me just show you guys something real quick. I. If I could, oh, it'll be funny if I find a kicker for cheap real quick. But kickers are going for a lot this year, guys. I'm not, look at this. 71 overall kickers are going for 21K. So if you pull a kicker out of a pack, if, especially if you pull like a Greg Zerlin, bro, you make it bank, bro. Invest in kickers this year, guys, because you need them for some, some of the solos. That's the GOAT right there, by the way. But yeah, guys, invest in kickers because kickers will save you a lot of time. And I feel like the auction mark auction is not really the best way to go as of right now because the game technically isn't out for everybody yet. So I say wait until next week when everybody's getting the stuff and all that and when the prices go down. I told my homie that on Friday the auction block is going to crash. I swear to you it's going to crash because once everybody else get the game, everything's going to be cheap. I recommend you go buy a lot of stuff because a lot of the elites will be cheap because the people won't know. So yeah, go ahead and do that. But this is my first um, Mutt tip video. Uh, if you guys want to see more, let me know down below. If you guys actually have different ways to get coins, let me know. And I'll feature you in the next Mutt tip video. Anyways, this is your boy Javern here. Remember to eat your Wheaties. Subscribe to my channel so you guys can get notifications when I actually upload by hitting that bell button as well. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.